Ladakh, the land of many passes. Located beyond the valleys of Kashmir, at an average height of 4,000 meters, Ladakh has a sparse population of barely two people per square kilometer. After independence, roads were built to bridge distances and link it with the rest of India. Roads, synonymous with development, brought children to schools. Although schooling reached remote corners of Ladakh, it was a system designed for failure. Though Ladakh responded with a high rate of school enrollment, only 3 to 5 percent students passed the 10th board exams. Children who spoke Ladakhi at home studied all subjects in Urdu till class 8, but wrote the 10th board exam in English. To meet the shortage of teachers, 8th pass Ladakhis were recruited, while those transferred from Kashmir saw their posting as a punishment. Year after year, students suffered at the hands of the system. Amongst the many traumatized children was Sonam Wangchuk. उन्होंने जितने उनके स्कूलों में जितने बच्चों को फेल किया है उनका शकल देखें यहाँ के इनके नहीं 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 फिर आपने किया आपके सिस्टम ने किया है इट इस कर्टियस ऑफ़ ए पब्लिक ऑफिसर टू फेस द पब्लिक इट फेस द पब्लिक आप हमसे शोर करवा रहे हैं As a child, I used to find school very difficult with all the Urdu, Hindi, English, and the teachers in this school used to punish me, hate me, ridicule me and I had started hating myself and my self-esteem had gone so low that I used to steal here and there and see myself as a criminal and think of suicide all the time. Then somehow I happened to change schools and in the second school the teachers were so compassionate and very skilled and they helped bring out the best in me. And soon my life took a U-turn and I was excelling in class and went on to enter engineering college. After finishing engineering in Kashmir, Sonam started a teaching center in Leh to help students pass the 10th board exams. I did strongly realize what difference a teacher can make in the life of a child. I soon realized that what Ladakh needed was not another engineer, but a change in the education system that could unshackle the thousands of engineers, teachers, thinkers that were wasting in a disastrous educational system. And I decided I was going to do that. The problem with education system in India is that 5% of the people have access to world-class schools, but the 95% have to do with schools without doors and windows, not to talk of laboratories and libraries. And with this kind of uh, approach, I think we have the recipe for future social uh, restlessness and conflicts. And here in Ladakh, we would try to resist that path. We would rather improve the government's infrastructure and give 
good quality education through it to all than to give very high quality education to just few handful people. We believe in raising the level of the ocean by one centimeter as more effective than raising a pond by one meter. Education for all has long been the dream of nations, a dream that entails a shared responsibility between the government and society. In Ladakh, this vision translated into a people's movement for change. After the winter vacations, on Sekmol's call, parents welcome teachers back to school. The year 1988 saw the beginning of Sekmol, the students' educational and cultural movement of Ladakh. Volunteers travelled across Ladakh and organised village meetings to convey the need for reforming the education system. For the first time, children, parents and community had a platform to articulate their concern about the government schooling system. Being able to dialogue with those who govern is the strength of any democracy. Sekmol initiated the transformation from neglect to action by making people voice their need for quality education. So we thought that unless education becomes a priority with the people, we cannot go and plead to our leaders, political leaders or the bureaucrats to change the system. And realizing this, we saw the importance of changing the priorities of the people, going to them and making them feel and see how in the long run it is education that will change their uh, conditions. Sixty kilometers from Leh is the village of Saspol. The people here were enthusiastic and willing to try out changes in the government high school. A sense of initiative and ownership was infused into the community. After overcoming the initial resistance from the education department, new partnerships were created to improve the system. English was adopted as the medium of instruction. Teachers who were trained to be child-friendly used joyful methods of learning. Very good. 99% accurate experiment. His experiment is 99.9% .9 accurate. Inspired by the Saspol experiment, many villagers now believed that it was possible to bring changes in a government school, making it as good as a private one. There was a growing awareness among officials and teachers to involve people in transforming the education system. 
In 1995, Ladakh was accorded the status of a hill council. The new government saw the relevance and popularity of Sekmol's intervention. This strategy of improving government schools was officially adopted as the education policy for Ladakh and was called Operation New Hope. NGO, community and state move together in cooperation and inclusion. ตาโอเลเชงอตาตุนซาโอเตวนอตาจุเวลอบเตซาตุกนังอิซัมเกลาโจโกสกาเวนังซินเตนงอตังอามัจบูร์ซงเตดิงยันตันเกลาทุบเ
आटे दरिये ऐसे चीजे इन लद्दाख द गवर्नमेंट स्पेंड फिफ्टीन हंड्रेड रुपीज पर मंथ फॉर एवरी चाइल्ड दैट वेंट टू स्कूल सेकमॉल बिलीव दैट दिस हाई एक्सपेंडिचर शुड ट्रांसलेट इन टू क्वालिटी एजुकेशन बाई इम्प्रूविंग द गवर्नमेंट स्कूलिंग सिस्टम राधर देन रिप्लेसिंग इट विद प्राइवेट स्कूल and inert accepting people realize the need for quality in education communities from remote corners of ladakh began to demand for what was the right of their children yoshi what to do कती चंगमा योंग जरा गने आका ओ दी का का दुल जरे यो सो यो सो दी मेंबर वा यो जा इन द एजुकेशन पॉलिसी ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया 1986 देयर वाज प्रोविजन फॉर द सेटिंग अप ऑफ विलेज एजुकेशन कमिटीज और वीईसीज दिस लेजिटिमाइज्ड पीपल्स पार्टिसिपेशन इन द एजुकेशन प्रोसेस and involve the community in the supervision and running of government schools a kujhe school ban gata sangna school jina sangna gata chalo ngati chiki jaro ngati thugu met stingin jaga niche ra thao samal hai fichano de pe niche thugje da de na chu chunga sam jung kan ji shel ma us kan katin la ten khon lo ngati विलेज एजुकेशन कमिटीज सून बिकेम एडेप्ट एट मेंटेनिंग स्कूल्स एंड इंटरैक्टिंग विद टीचर्स बट देर वर मोर कॉम्प्लेक्स इश्यूज टू बी एड्रेस्ड लद्दाख पॉप्युलेशन इज स्कैटर्ड ओवर वास्ट एक्सपांसिस ऑफ माउंटेन्स villages often comprise of only 20 or 30 families as a result primary schools have very few students while middle and high schools are not easy to access For most children education halted abruptly after the primary level to circumvent the problem village communities from the remote area of changtang made a bold decision middle schools were downgraded to the primary level so that effort could be concentrated on building the centralized residential high school now this is a a uh, very difficult thing for vi- villagers to digest to downgrade their middle schools to primary normally people are always chanting upgradation of primary to middle middle to high high to higher secondary and so on but in this region people showed a very uh, you know high sense of wisdom when they decided that yes it's not serving us quantity or namesake schools are not helping us we would rather pool our resources and make one good uh, residential school
This approach had the potential to solve the problems of remote areas in Ladakh. Acknowledging its value, the government made it into a policy. Sekmal arranged for additional financial resources and building material. Na dugo ko laga se se nahi le. Yika ngaje thau thau tu sa yontan ngala metka ne thukje tata sang mane yontan gale glove ka samde ngaja hala hun din le. For five years, every family from this region provided a minimum of four weeks of shramdan or voluntary labor to build the solar heated residential school at Durbuk Changtang. Sekmal's initiative has blurred the lines of divide between those who supply education, those who demand it, and those who intervene. Community is redefined to include state and NGO. No one is absolved of responsibility, and in the true sense, there is participation at every level. <laughs> Chospel is amongst the many students who have benefited from Sekmal's intervention. He was one of the first to pass the 10th board exams from his village. He is now a graduate and a government school teacher. Sekmal has touched the lives of students and has involved them in spreading the message of change. Student volunteers embark on yet another campaign that will cover 15 villages over a distance of 200 kilometers. Yul yul na hui si yo kya pa ha village education committee rangla yul yun tan saspa tene khachi ketna ma gya la la shokhan yo do khachi ketna te jam la shokhan je med do aga ketna ngata chap so testing na last ma chokhan chito na yo yang pat ko ma chajik ma lap tata sultan ma na masam chik te na go ba kya panch yo kya sar panch yo kya ya do men na gaste last yo te men na chipia ma chan te wo ngata ar gyum san dik ti je men reason ha causes po chi do chipia yi un ma chan je khung गोबा नंग माडी गदुगा मेबान नंग माडी गदुगा याते युली वी सी चेयरमैन बखे नंग माना लेस दुखान चिन ओसो पासन दो चोला युली नंग यंता नि सिरकाव काजु छि दो चोसी आइडिया जिंग आता इतु जोस्ते कोचेस ठीक दंग माना यंग स्पेरा चिक्सी मिर्जे चासी चिते वाला ना यंता नंग यरगिया सी शर्जी ना पमो चोचे सिपिया सम्मा सम्मा कोते नंग सम्मा
نیزش کت نون دانه یه حالا دنگ آب 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 نیزش کت نون دانه یه حالا د What has merged into a collective wave of action needs to continue for real change to be seen. Perceptions have to permanently alter in such a way that quality education for every child need not be negotiated for. How many generations will it take for this to happen? Will there ever be forever sunshine? The answer lies in changing the system in every village where there are primary schools, where there are middle schools and high schools. And these schools, if they are reformed, if they are improved, then coaching courses are not required. Then SECMOL is not required. So in that way, we started realizing that we should do things that actually eliminates the need for a SECMOL. So in those ways, the greatest success of SECMOL would be when it is no longer needed, when people say, we don't need you anymore.